Well, hello, everyone. I'm thrilled to be here and kick off Oracle TV with Seema Verma, Executive Vice President and General Manager of Oracle Health and Life Sciences. Seema, it's so great to sit down with you at this moment that it's a pivotal moment. It's a monumental moment because you have changed the tone of how we're talking about what's happening in healthcare. And you started out with AI is no longer a future investment. It's an immediate necessity, which is a powerful an urgent statement. So can you tell us a little bit more about that tone that you started with and also give us a glimpse at the state of the industry? So first off, I would say that this and this conference, it marked a milestone for Oracle, right? So since the Cerner acquisition three years ago, there was a lot of skepticism. Are they really going to do it? Are they really going to fulfill the vision that they've articulated. And I think that this is the milestone. We delivered the new ambulatory EHR. We're previewing the new acute EHR. And then there's all kinds of other products around that. Our new life sciences, AI data platform, we're putting out real world data, new analytical tools. We're bringing out new payer tools. And so finally, we're seeing that Oracle's investment after three years is actually producing what we said it would. And I think it's I think it is a real milestone also for the industry because the industry has not really had a formidable competitor and they do now. And the thing we know about competition is it's going to drive quality, it's going to bring down the cost for the entire market. So I think this is an important moment for healthcare overall and for the market. If we think about what's going on in healthcare, right? Healthcare costs becoming more unsustainable for governments, for employers. We're also hearing about burnout from providers. We're hearing frustration for patients. And the good thing is, a lot of the products that we are bringing out are going to fix long standing problems in healthcare. Mm. So I couldn't be more excited because I feel like there's finally a big, large hammer to go to those nails and address these problems that we've been talking about for years without any real tangible solutions. And we have those now. And and I've, I've heard you say this, but we're not talking about it. Anymore. We're delivering it, which is a big difference. And so, you know, going back to that answer, which you kind of answered it a, a little bit, but I would love for you to go on a little bit about more, is how is Oracle uniquely positioned to address these pressure points that that we're feeling right now. Can you talk a little bit more about that? So look, across the board, we are putting AI in action. So we're bringing AI across our entire platform, entire the entire suite of applications that we offer to the market. And this is very unique. We're not bolting on AI. Mm -hmm. And one of the things that we talked about is Oracle's AI strategy generally as a company. No other company in the world is bringing AI to healthcare like Oracle is. And it's not just the products that we're bringing to the market. It's the underlying infrastructure, right? We have the best cloud in the world. We're seeing that at today's great news, um, we're hearing that our cloud is just growing exponentially. And we're seeing whether it's healthcare organizations or the largest AI, um, you know, all of the open AI is coming, Grok is coming. So we're seeing this flock of AI companies come to the Oracle cloud. And so we have, you know, a whole AI platform that not only brings these suite of products, but it sits on this underlying AI platform that makes AI work in a very superior way. We talked a lot about that. So it's the data. It's also a platform that allows our customers to build their own AI models as well, their own AI agents. So you can take our AI agents, you can build your own, you can ingest other ones. So if you think about it, it's the infrastructure It's the products that have AI. It's the platform that hosts all of these AI products um, that allows you to ingest other AI products, uh, you know, build your own AI agent. So I think that combination, there's really no other company in the world that's bringing all of that to healthcare specifically. Yes. And as you said, it's not bolted on, it's built in. So with that in mind, what do we have in motion right now? We have so much in motion. <laughs> we couldn't be more excited about this conference because we are showing products across yeah. the entire ecosystem. So obviously our new EHR, that's a big one. We are bringing new products for payers and providers to reduce the friction points between the two of them. We're bringing new products in life sciences where we're bringing our new data platform. We're bringing new real world data to the market with analytical tools. We're also bringing um, a better way to conduct clinical trials and bringing AI to that process as well. 
So it's payers, it's providers. We even talked about public health and how we're going to be bringing new products to countries and states to do public health surveillance using real world data. So across the board, payers, providers, the one thing that I'm very passionate about is what we're bringing to the market for patients. Yes. You know, the, the new patient portal is putting AI in the hands of our patients so that they can ask questions about their health care, about their longitudinal health record. We're finally giving patients access to their complete medical record and the ability to ask questions about it and to understand it better and understand what they need to do to be healthier. That's incredible. Incredible. So how, what role do our partnerships play in that then? Partnerships are really important because one of the things I think we have the humility to say, this is a massive transformation that we are trying to drive, but that we also acknowledge we can't do this alone. It's going to take all of us coming together. So one of the things that underlies our system is an open ecosystem, and that means that partners can plug in as well. We want our customers to be able to avail the latest innovation, whether that comes from Oracle or it comes from another innovator, because that's what's best for the healthcare system. That's what's best for patients. So it comes with an open ecosystem that partners can also participate in advancing innovation. Um, we're also very um, excited about working with our system integrators. You know, we know that there's going to be such great demand for our products, and we want to be able to deliver this all over the world as quickly as we can. And in order to do that, we need help. We need partners to help us deploy this great technology. We're excited that, you know, we've also invested not only in the products, but also in the time to value, which means these are not going to be you know, three, four-year implementations that people have had in the past. This is going to go fast. These are going to happen in hopefully less than a year is the target. And so, again, we still need partners to help us do that because we know there's such a, going to be such a great demand um, for all of this AI in action in, for healthcare. Absolutely. Well, Seema, you are leading Oracle Health and Life Sciences at a pivotal time in our history where AI is going to change how we work. So how do you see the next three to five years changing healthcare, and where do you see we fit into that? I think Oracle's leading this transformation. There's no other company that's putting this type of resources into it an end-to-end. We're not just a point solution. We're not just doing ERP. We're not just doing the EHR. We're not just doing clinical trials. We're doing all of it. And the reason why we're doing all of it is because at the end of the day, it's for patients. And patients experience all of this. They experience problems with their insurance companies and payers. So we have to do providers, payers patients, pharma companies, researchers, we have to do all of it. And that's what's exciting to me is that I think this is going to have an incredible impact on healthcare, going to solve a lot of these longstanding challenges and really put us into a new era where there's more innovation, faster cures and treatments to advance the human condition. So I couldn't be more excited. I'm excited too. Well, thank you so much, Seema. I could sit down and talk with you forever. And I know you can't, but I know we'll have many moments to do just that. But I appreciate you taking the time to dive into AI in action. It's an exciting moment for us all. And we're going to be right back to Oracle TV.